السلام علیکم ویری فروٹفل سیشن سر مائی کوشچن یو آر ٹوٹلی اباؤٹ اباؤٹ آسک فری لانسنگ از افیکٹیو اینڈ دا گریٹ وے ہاؤ ٹو فری لانسنگ بٹ یو آر ڈیڈنٹ نو اباؤٹ آسک ٹو کہ ہاؤ ٹو کریٹ این اکاؤنٹ اینڈ ہاؤ ٹو گیٹ اے منی پروسیجر پلیز ٹیل می اباؤٹ ہاؤ ٹو کریٹ اکاؤنٹ اٹ ڈپینڈز آن دا پلیٹ فارم سو ایوری پلیٹ فارم از اے ڈفرنٹ سائن اپ پروسیجر اینڈ اے ویلیڈیشن پروسیجر اینڈ دین یو نیڈ ٹو probably have a pioneer account to receive money from the platform however this is how to start so i cannot tell you all the platforms how you sign up for them because the process is different so some some uh platforms require validation with an id card some don't some ask you to tell your location some don't fiverr.com does not when you create a platform they automatically detect where you're making the account from so uh the 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 process for every platform is different So I cannot generalize that. Things that I cannot generalize, I can't talk about them. But sign up process, like you sign up on Facebook, it's exactly the same thing. Thank you. If you want to role play, we can do that as well. Good evening, so, sir. Good evening, sir. How are you? Good. Sir, I have a question that uh, you are talking about communication skills with clients. So, Can you tell about more uh, communication tactics and strategies uh, with clients? Because I have tried a lot of time, but I, I got failure. All right. So thank you so much. All right. So, okay. What, what do you provide? Yeah, I'm a content writer. Content writer, but, okay. But uh, I have work on uh, Facebook and uh, Instagram, but uh, it's my first time on Upwork. So I got lots of client, but always I just fail because of my communication skills. Okay. Yeah. So you're a content writer. What kind of content do you write? Yeah, I write about history and uh, I research papers like on uh, trend topics. You can see. Okay. Yeah. You're a client. I'm a content writer. Okay. You're a client that I've, I've given you a proposal or you're co- contacting me. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a writer. Okay. Right okay. now, I'm a writer. Okay. okay. So you're the client. You ask me, ask me something, or I've, I've proposed. Okay, so you're looking for the solution. I'm, I'm a con. You're looking for, okay, so you want me to write about the history of Pakistan. Can you tell me exactly what you want me to write about the history of Pakistan? Yeah, uh, you will write a history for me about uh, the issues that uh, happens in past that right. change over uh, uh, two days uh, Uh, today's um, situations, political situations. Okay, and what will your target audience be? So, uh, as far as I can tell, you want to know exactly what happened in the past that is now affecting our future. So, my question is that if you want me to write about this, what, what is your target audience? Who will this article be written for? The article for uh, the people who are, you know, like politics, and uh, mostly uh, using uh, po- uh, social media to entertain, entertain them with politics. So I'm writing an le- article for them. No, so I'm a little confused right now. You want me to write about uh, entertain... This is going to be an article for to entertain people. So it's not going to be a serious article for information. It's b- supposed to be for entertaining people. Yeah, it's for uh, uh, entertain people who love politics. Okay, so it's for... entertaining people that love politics. Okay, so now what I understand is, is that you want me to write an article for you based on, the his, uh, based on Pakistan's history in a funny manner presented in an entertaining way so that, uh, so that uh, we can entertain people that also like politics and we can have a little bit of jokes from here and there and some of the, uh, some of the mistakes that people have made in the past. Does that sound fair? Yes, sir. I got okay, so fine. How many words do you want for this article? It depends on the. Uh, it's depend on you because uh, it will be a maximum, uh, like 500 words or for like 200 words between 200 to 500 words. Okay, so what do you think will provide the most value to your audience? 500 or 200 words? I think so. It will be best for, for them to 200 words. 200 words. words. So yeah. you want a short article with some jokes and uh, something funny which will entertain people. Yes. All right, fine. I can do it between two dollars to ten dollars. what do you think the value of your article should be because based on the based on what you say right now between two dollars to ten dollars i'll have to use my resources based on that so tell me 
It should be near to seven or eight dollars. Seven to eight dollars, fine. I'll, what I can do is right now I can work on like say fifty to uh, fifty words. Right now, I'll work on the, that. It'll be the first draft. Once I give it to you, you can tell me whether the direction is incorrect. If it's if uh, whether the direction is correct or not. If it's incorrect, we can talk about what direction we should take from here. Does that sound fair? Yes, that sounds fair. Fine. Let's work on it. Thank you. That's good, man. That's so good. Uh, thank you very much. My question is about uh, you said uh, you should be a better you you should be a good seller. Uh, can you suggest some techniques in start that uh, uh, you uh, that how should you should improve as a good seller? Okay, so uh, 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 sir, S excuse me. Uh, you you basically. Uh, I was selling to you right now. Did you did you take note of that? I use price yes, bracketing. Yes. Then I asked the client yes, what yes. the solutions are, what yes, he requires. Yes. That was part of sales. So, I, what specifically? What is the question that you're uh, that? What is the spe what specifically do you want me to answer in that sales tactics? I use price bracketing. I I I ask the client what I will what I will provide, how I will provide it, and okay. what what are the tactics that I will use to provide the solution that he, he that the client requires. So what specifically do you want me to answer? Uh, I mean, uh, this is, I think this is our communication. This is. Uh, yeah, it, it was sales. You, sh you should be good at communication yeah. skills. Yeah. A and any other one? Uh, well, price bracketing, price like I said, two hundred two to ten dollars, then he answered me. So I said, okay, we'll do, we'll do like the 50 words first. Let's see if the direction I engaged him. Okay. So basically, I've engaged the client now. I know for certain that he is he is working with me, and now it really depends on whether we can connect after that. Okay. Whether probably I send the fifty words, the client says no, this is not what we are looking for. Then I'll say okay, fine, you go your way, I'll go mine. Okay. Thank you very much. Uh, one thing which is, uh, uh, you know, where Indians, they have edge over Pakistanis because uh, the export, for, for instance, I mean, the export of Indian uh, software values like uh, $130 billion a year, whereas Pakistan stands at only $2 billion a year. It's a, it's a heck of a difference. I mean, India is six times bigger than Pakistan. It, they, sh they should be selling like uh, software f worth uh, uh, 12 billion, you know, if we go by that proportion. By the proportion. But, but they, you know, it's, it's so, but a lot of people say that Indians have success, and especially the freelancers and uh, the service for online service providers, they have success um, uh, over, I mean, they have more success uh, than Pakistanis do because they have they can speak better English okay now the problem is I mean I'm asking a question but uh, in a way I'm also answering it so I hope you won't mind that uh, okay now the thing is that uh, a lot of people I mean I've seen a lot of uh, rhetoric going around like uh, national identity like Urdu make Urdu our uh, you know, everything like we should be f proud of our language and ma boli Punjabi sanu bolni chahidi Punjabi is gal karo. Instead of going, uh, what I have seen the makeups of this society is that instead of progressing, they are regress. They they are it's a regressing society. We talk more about. Uh, things which have no use, no practical use when we come to international markets. I mean, an average uh, Indian and or an average Sri Lankan or even a Bangladeshi can speak, speak and converse better in English than an average Pakistani can. What are your comments? Yes, it's true. <laughs> okay. <laughs>